Hey there, it's Kazoom. Well, the grand reopening of the fourth dimension went as well as could be expected, considering that Super Bowl 50 was happening at the time. <laughs> and uh, <clears throat> most of the people in the uh, fourth dimension group, um, groups in Second Life, you can, you can uh, start group chats, you can uh, be sure to be let known when there are events, event notices, things like that. And, you know, most of the people that are in the fourth dimension group that I had initially advertised it in uh, don't really come in Second Life anymore. I haven't seen them, most of them there in ages, so... You know, so it, it went as well as could be expected. There's about eight or nine people. Um, but it was still a blast. It was so good to see some of the people I hadn't seen in so long. And most of them were furries. I tend to get along with furries pretty good. I, I like furries. Um, I may not technically consider myself a furry, even though, well, sometimes some of the artwork I think is pretty fucking cool. There's some that's kind of hot, actually. So maybe I am a furry, I don't know. <laughs> I have no... I, I definitely have no desire to wear a fursuit or anything like that. I just I just appreciate some of the artwork sometimes. And uh, But in Second Life, I tend to find the furries to be the ones that... It, it's a demographic in Second Life that I consider to be the ones who seem to have the most fun. They, they take it the least seriously. Um, and yet I know so many of them that have met uh, other people in person because of Second Life. So, then again, I know people who have gotten married where they originally met in Second Life. So, you know, um, <clears throat> I will be DJing at my club on Wednesdays and Sundays uh, at uh, 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. Pacific Time. Hopefully, I will be DJing at uh, a place called Heart of Gold, which is a furry club. Uh, soon. Uh, I just wanted to establish some things first. Um, hopefully I'll be putting my club into Second Life Destinations soon. I want to have it be there for a couple more weeks before I do that. It just seems, doesn't seem realistic to just to just immediately put it in destin- try to apply for it being in destinations when it was just put up. But I guess some other clubs have done that too, but I want to wait a couple weeks on that. And, uh, so yeah, things are going good. Um, don't really have much to complain about. It's nice to be in the mode of having fun again, because there, there were so long that I was just involved in this, in the whole, so much of the drama thing. Especially between, you know, uh, uh, feminism and anti-feminism and all that sort of thing, you know. What's funny is sometimes some of the people that I see that will talk about how feminists don't know how to have fun or SJWs don't know how to have fun are people that it's pretty obvious they don't know how to have fun either. Now, don't get me wrong, this is not... I'm not saying this by a majority, but I just, I've seen it a number of times. It's just like, it, it, it's kind of funny when you look at it from afar, but, um, but I was one of those people, you know? So involved in being anti-something that I forgot what being pro the things that I enjoy were, you know? So, um. Generally, things are going well, though. And uh, I guess I'll end the video.